I'm absolutely exhausted from that shopping spree. Well, so am I. But it's the best shopping spree I've had in ages. Oh, yes it was. <gasps> you know what? Shop until we drop. That's my motto. Risotto? What? You said risotto. Risotto? No, I said shop until we drop. That's my motto. Oh, right. Really? Oh, I've been meaning to ask. Hmm. Did, you, did you go and see that Italian clairvoyant? No. No, I didn't actually. Oh. Yeah, a bit odd that, actually. I did phone a couple of times, but no answer. Hmm. Kind of weird. Oh, hmm. Did you leave her a message at all? Well, I left two messages. Hmm. But didn't get a reply. So I just imagine she's on holiday. She could have, um... <laughs> could she? She could. <laughs> oh, I really hope she did. <laughs> I don't know what that is exactly. But well, she she's clear body. She could think of anything. I know. Really. I know. You know. She could make it up. <laughs> and she goes, oh, oh, we just did. All right, OK. Well, no, I left two messages on the answer phone, but I just imagine she's away. Well, I thought she would have put something on there saying she's away, wouldn't you? Yeah, say, I don't know. And all burgers here. I'm off for the weekend and... Uh, <laughs> Come and help yourself to all of your things. Got lots of lots of lovely goodies and art and things like that. Yes. <laughs> yeah, do come round. You know, do come along with the van. The car's in the airport. Yeah. <laughs> Take it away. <laughs> oh, really? <coughs> okay. So, what should we do now? You know, read the rest of the script. We should really, shouldn't we? <laughs> slightly. Do you remember that lady from that wedding event? Yes, you know, the one that was shoveling the food in her handbag. Oh yes, yes, yes. It was probably those little tiny sausages for her dogs. Yes. You know, not those puke chicken sausages. No. No, it wasn't that at all. She was shoveling linguini in her handbag. Linguini? What? Linguini. She was shoveling linguini. No, it's pronounced Italian, darling. It's called Linguini. Yes, I said it first. I said it right the first time. Linguini. <laughs> I felt so embarrassed. I had to actually go up and say to her, Madam, do excuse me, but you've actually got Linguini dangling out of your handbag. And it could be terribly dangerous. Yes, very dangerous slipping on a piece of Linguini. I was absolutely mortified. One could slip and sort of damage one's derriere. Or where, or should we say where I come from, your jacksy. <laughs> okay, Cheryl. Well, let's put the things away. And let's go and try that new Italian that they're all raving about round the corner. What do you think? That would be nice. I just hope we don't bump into Mrs. Ligini there. <laughs> She's probably downing a risotto as we speak. Oh, you never know. If she has been there, we'll see the trail that she'll leave behind with all the linguini on the pavement. Should we go? Yes. Let's go and try out Mamma Mia. Mia. Toodle bit. <laughs> 